and the cabinets are done. What do you think? To me, they look amazing. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Warwick and you're watching Gas Tax Garage, the channel that's here to help you figure out how to build your dream garage. And right behind me is my second edition of my dream garage. If you've been with me for a while, you know I built this garage out about a year and a half ago, and today is time for a refresh. And I just got myself some new garage cabinets. So let's jump right into today's video. So if you're new to the channel, thanks for stopping by. If you're a longtime subscriber, always good to have you back. Today is an exciting day because I'm starting to finish my garage build. And one of the biggest components of a garage build is your cabinetry and your storage. Right behind me in the distance is actually my Sonic cabinets and tools. I actually work on cars or rebuild cars or motorcycles or tinker with things, however you want to put it. So those are all my tools in there. Now across this wall, it's about uh, 30 feet or 35 feet. I needed space for all my car parts, uh, you know, household. Uh, maintenance things and I used to have two different cabinets up there the new age bold and pro I've done many videos on those so be sure you check those out but since I'm here to help you figure out how to build your dream garage I can't keep the same cabinets and I wanted to try something new to broaden my knowledge and help you guys out so today I have purchased one set of cabinets called the ultimate cabinets and they're gonna go all the way across the back wall here. Now, before we jump into the actual assembly and install of these cabinets, I am running a giveaway from now until the end of the year. Three different giveaways where you can win a portion of up to $18,000 of Sonic tools. So make sure you check out the link down below for how to enter. But basically, one comment per video equals an entry. If you want to support the channel and go to gastax.com, purchase a hat, shirt, or hoodie, you get three entries per dollar spent. So be sure you check that out. So as you can see, there are a lot of boxes. I actually purchased the 19-piece cabinet set, but then I purchased additional cabinet uh, to fill in the work space or workbench area. I'll put a picture up on the screen now of what it's supposed to look like. Now, when you're looking at the color, they offer a couple different colors, but the one color I went for is gray, and this is uh, the gray color of the cabinet. Now, guys, I'm gonna do a bunch of videos on the install. I'm gonna do a video of how to assemble each one of the cabinets. I'm going to do an overall before and after video. I'm going to do how to hang these on the wall. So be sure you like and subscribe if you're interested in getting these cabinets because I will be giving you a lot of information to see if these cabinets are the right cabinets for you. Now guys, I have purchased all of these cabinets from garageorganization.com. If you go down to the description below and use those links, it helps support my channel so I can come out and give you all the content you need and the videos you need to help figure out how to build your dream garage. So support me, support garageorganization.com so I can help bring you more garage footage. Alrighty, so how I'm going to start is I'm going to assemble one of each of the cabinets. Let's go through this. We have six two-door large tall boxes. We have six two-door space-saving cabinets. We have three four-drawer medium base boxes. And then we have three two-door medium base boxes. And then those little boxes are actually just the cabinets or the drawers. Uh, they package the, the main structure and then the door separately because the doors come in different colors. That's also the door color. And then we have 12 foot, or well, broken down into two six foot bamboo uh, work countertops. Now, if you saw in the picture I put up on the screen before, this is a symmetrical design. There's three tall cabinets, then the small cabinets and workbench in the middle, and then three tall cabinets. That's exactly how I'm going to set this up. That way the workstation is dead center in the, gar in the middle of the garage. I do have a four car garage if you see behind me. Alrighty guys, I've unboxed one of the two door tall large boxes. And I'm gonna tell you my first impressions are 
There's a lot of parts, but this is super thick. Uh, like, yes, it's particle board, but it's heavy. Uh, it's the thickest particle board I've seen with ev any kind of this IKEA-esque assembly. So here are all the parts for just one box. I'm kind of dreading the install because there's six of those and a whole bunch more, you know. But I am so far impressed. Ultimate Cabinets has a 10-year warranty against uh, manufacturing defects. Obviously, that's what warranties are for. If you damage it, obviously that's on you. But here are the screw and legs, the hardware, and look at this. This is 10 times better than I've seen any assembled furniture come in. Uh, nicely organized, nice little hard case. Um, instructions look great so far. So, so far, I would give a, an A on the packaging um, and the organization of this cabinetry. But let's get assembling and see how it looks and then jump on to the other ones. Let's jump in. I'm gonna put you guys on a time lapse and hopefully you enjoy this video.
Well guys, I installed all the handles and the cabinets are done. What do you think? To me, they look amazing. If you found those videos helpful and you would like to purchase the cabinets, there is a link down below that helps support the channel every time you purchase from there. If you have any questions about these cabinets, feel free to ask me. I buy these cabinets to try them out to give you guys first-hand experience. If you are looking for different cabinets, be sure you check out all my previous videos as well because I've reviewed a bunch of them. But guys, I am giving away a whole bunch of tools this year, so make sure you check out the link down below that will tell you how to enter to win. But until next time, thanks a lot for tuning in and I'll see you then.